Sung in Treasure is the part of the show where I am going to show off some of the really, really cool toys I started collecting during the uh, the great lockdown. Today, we're opening the Basilisk Attack Playset! Basically, the story behind it is I saw it, it was really cool, and I wanted it. So I went out and I got myself one. Mattel number 54930, originally released in 2002 uh, to coincide, obviously, with the Chamber of Secrets. There's so many things you can do! You get to chop off a snake's head over and over and over again! It's just bananas! Now, I got it thinking that it was already open. I didn't realize that it was sealed. So I really, really wanted to play with it for months. But I couldn't justify taking such a beautiful toy out of the box. But since we're all doing it together, we might as well. Plus, I came to terms with the fact... Oh, oh hello. In my toy collecting that toys are supposed to be played with, all right? If you keep them in boxes forever, they're not fulfilling their life's mission. Sometimes you gotta just do it. You gotta break the rules. Oh. Let's take a look. Okay, so here, obviously, Chamber of Secrets. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, we're taped a million different ways, I'll tell you what. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's still tied in another time. Oh my gosh, how many times are you gonna tie this snake down? I say. Wait, it doesn't come with the Harry Potter? Oh, figure not included. You sneakies. Oh, he's so cool. Oh, he's so cool. Okay, take a look at this. Oh! Oh, he's like genuinely scary too. Oh, well, batteries. Mm. Oh, oh, what does your tail do? Okay, hold on, we've got to put batteries in this thing immediately. I have to know what he does. Assembling toys on Christmas must be every parent's worst nightmare. Lot of Christmases ruined by you, Mattel. Oh, that's so scary. Look at this guy. He tilts his little neck down. <laughs> hey, enough out of you for a second, okay? Thank you. Let's see what we gotta do to assemble the actual playset now. Oh, I guess we could read instructions first, huh? All right, we'll leave him here to entertain you while I try to figure this out. Why don't you tell him a joke? I don't know. Why did your mom cross the road? Filthy. Enough with that potty mouth. This is a family show. The Chamber of Secrets has been opened. Oh. Ah! Oh, yes! Oh, yeah! There we go! Give me that toothpick! Ah! God. Sword first. <gasps> what do you want, Snake? What do you want with my babies? Get away from my babies and my taters! He's a rural Idaho farmer in this cut. I don't know why. My tater babies ain't for you! Get away from them tater babies! <sighs> Give me them tater babies! Give me that Hold on. I had to go get tater babies. Get away from my tater babies, you big snake! You don't mess with Idaho! But I want them tater babies! You give me them tater babies! Ah, no! Get back! Ah! Ah! No, Jessica! Jessica, no! Oh no! She just sprouted her first teeth. Gone too young. Now be gone, Paul! And he's dead, but I have to turn him off or he'd be dead. And that is the end. And the Tater Babies survived. I don't know why Tater Babies. I just happen to have potatoes. Now, as far as a review of this thing, it is pretty cool looking. Uh, I will say the lights and the sound effects are rad. I wish. It didn't do it all the time. I wish it only did it when you push the neck down like this. But it does just happen to just set itself off constantly. I'm a little upset it didn't include a Harry Potter figure, but I had one, so it wasn't the end of the world. The idea behind the Chamber of Secrets is very cool. It is very fun. I love that you can open it from the other side. Um, 
I wouldn't say it's ease of instructions. <laughs> Is it strong suit? Because I messed it up a bunch of times. I'm still gonna go ahead out of five nightcap stars, give this one a two and a half. It's a little more expensive than I think it's worth uh, what you get. And this is a little complicated to put together, but if you find one for a good deal, I would snag it because it is really cool. Look at it.